we have learned how to create the plant percent complete with the help of a number of microsoft project inbuilt fields functions and of course we have applied our own formulas taking a number of custom fields which you have seen before now i'm going to explore some special situations or scenarios which confound a number of ms project practitioners in fact i get these questions frequently they are getting a number of error notifications in their fields why it happens let us take the first scenario the first scenario is the status date has not been set or the planner or the manager has forgotten to set the status date let us see how it happens i am going to go to the project tab under that status group and status date i am going to execute that command currently this is populated i am going to put na meaning not applicable now when i do that as you can see in plan percent complete error notifications are coming the reason is inside our formula we have considered the status date in built ms project field so if you have not set the status date properly you are going to have error notifications now i'm going to revert back by doing undo to go back to the original state and set the status date to our previous status state next situation is the planner or the project manager has forgotten to set the baseline or even if they have set the baseline they have not set properly let us see that scenario now here i have the baseline in the graphical side as you can see the baseline is noted with this horizontal black bold bar and the status date is with respect to this red line to remove the baseline i have to go to the project tab schedule group and go to the set baseline command and say clear baseline our baseline has been set and i can clear this baseline so i'm going to say okay that means the baseline has been cleared so when the baseline is cleared you are going to have error notifications again because in our formula we are also considering the baseline start as well as the baseline duration let us see i'm going to select this plan percent complete and right click choose custom fields in the right side type category i'm going to choose the number custom fields we have taken from number 1 till number 3 three, these three custom fields for number 1 i am going to select on formula and the formula as you can see is considering the baseline start as well as the status date number 2 inside it we have the baseline duration considered so if you have not set the baseline of course you are going to have error notifications so again i am going to revert back to the original plan by going to do undo and we are having the values properly populated there is another scenario also i see people ask me what will happen if i add a new task will the formula work let us see so here let us say of before the phase 1 is getting completed we have another task so i'm going to right click and say insert task and have a special task here so the special task is of two days duration now here also in the plan percent complete we are getting the error field the reason is for this special task we do not have the baseline set to see that i am going to right click and insert the column and have baseline start and as well as let us say baseline duration so as you can see for the work packages the baseline start as well as baseline duration field has been properly populated for this special task the baseline start is showing na that is not applicable the baseline duration is zero with a question mark it means it has not been set that is also reflected on the graphical side so how to solve this scenario simply set the baseline or rewrite the baseline so i am going to go to again project tab schedule group set baseline and here i am going to set the baseline now already we have set the baseline you can choose another baseline baseline 1 or if you have multiple baselines you can go to baseline 10 up to that so here i am going to rewrite the existing baseline and say okay it is asking me are you sure you want to overwrite the data in this baseline yes we want to do that now as i did that now the value will be properly shown so here it is as on this date it should have been 100% complete for this special task and it is showing it is properly 100% complete but do note that this baseline just got overwritten compared to the previous baseline and the hence the percentage values got changed now you will be thinking what happens when i have multiple baselines do i have to change the formula 
yes if you have multiple baselines then in that case again i am going to the custom fields the number custom field and the formula say you are on baseline 3 so you have to tell baseline 3 start and they are also in the next number 2 you have to tell baseline 3 durations now you do not want to continuously change because you might set a number of baseline in such a case you have to just put some nested if conditions which will switch among the baselines or you can have a switch statement which is also an inbuilt Microsoft project function and it is more efficient compared to an SDF to have the proper reflection with respect to the plan percent complete. So this is how you have a number of scenarios with respect to no status state setting, no baseline setting or you have multiple baselines or you have added a new work package or a new task irrespective of that as you have put the formulas in a proper way and have settings in a proper way you are going to have plant percent complete field populated properly